Jerry with Venture Painting. Uh, Brooke Clanton with Venture Painting. Um, I am the owner and operator. Basically, you've got your your outside crews and your inside crews, and then normally there's crews that do kind of the final detail work. There's commercial work. I mean, paint goes on almost everything. You know, there's a wide range of areas you can go into. So production would basically be you're coming into a new home that's being built, so no surface has been treated at all. And so they are doing a lot of spraying, they are lifting more buckets. It's definitely a more labor intensive side of the business. You had a lot of prep work, which prep work is a huge deal and you need to have a good eye so you know what it's gonna look like when it's covered with paint, make sure it looks good. Um, the other end would be more of the touch up, the warranty. You're dealing with less big machinery and stuff. Uh, it's mostly brushes and rollers. It's, it's good to try and go through all those phases. It's a good job. It's not super heavy labor, which is good, so you're not lifting a lot of heavy things. It's something that definitely a woman can get into. You know when you're working. You're not getting called in at odd hours. You don't have day schedules and night shifts where in other businesses you might. It's pretty, you know, regular nine to five stuff. And you're not in an office, so if you don't like office work, it's a great way to be out and about. You're always at a new house, doing new things. Um, I don't think as far as construction goes, it's going to slow down anytime soon, so I think there's plenty of room for advancement and, and uh, longevity in the job. It's a skill that you can carry on for a really long time. Even if you do other things, it's a great way to have a fallback plan. Approaching a painter and say, hey, are you hiring? Do you know someone that's hiring? Most painting companies, the first thing they're going to ask you is how many years experience do you have? That's why most people start on next year your cruise because it's the easiest place to just get going. You go to any superintendent on a job site and they'd be able to point you in the right direction of who's hired and who's not. You might even get, sometimes get hired on the spot depending on how the work is. We're always looking for new painters. I have to turn down work at this point because I don't have the labor to do the work. As far as you want to go with it, I really feel like you can. You get some basic skills and you can do a lot. 